Load a 1.2 milliliter syringe with liquid EDTA 18% from the indispense syringe and attach a 30 gauge navi tip. Next, load a 1.2 milliliter syringe with concepsis, 2% chlorhexidine gluconate, and attach a 30 gauge navi tip. Fill the canal with the liquid EDTA 18% and allow this to soak for 30 to 60 seconds. Where chlorocid is ideal for removing organic matter from the canal, liquid EDTA will break down inorganic matter such as the smear layer and expose the dentinal tubules. Evacuate the canal. Now fill the canal with concepsis, chlorhexidine gluconate. Allow this to soak for five minutes. Studies have shown that a five minute soak with chlorhexidine will provide up to ten weeks of antimicrobial protection in the canal. Evacuate one last time with the lure vacuum adapter to remove the concepsis from the canal and blot out the canals using one to two paper points. Because we will be sealing the canal with endores, it is not necessary to desiccate the canal. Leaving the canal slightly damp will provide the best environment for endores to penetrate into the tubules. We are now ready to move on to the obturation portion of the procedure. The endores system includes endores points, which are gutta percha points with a unique resin coating which allow the gutta percha to bond covalently to the endores sealer. Endores is the ideal canal sealer when apically delivered via a 29 gauge navi tip, eliminating gaps and voids. No pressure or heat is required. The sealer's hydrophilic feature will allow it to follow the residual moisture deep into the dentinal tubules and readily flow into intricate canal spaces and auxiliary canals. Because endores is completely biocompatible, any endores that may be inadvertently expressed beyond the apex will be metabolized by the body in 3 to 12 months.